Yo, what's poppin' guys, Sizzle here, and this is going to be a quick tutorial on how to get rid of all the input delay on Minecraft Windows 10 Edition or Better Condition. Now, this is PC exclusive, so for everyone else, I'm really sorry, but I don't know how to change this on any consoles. Um, but for anyone on PC, it's very simple. Go to your C drive, then users, go to your user, which wouldn't be public or default, it'll be whatever you named your computer. Uh, then go to app data and you might not see this in order to do that you go to view it says hidden hidden items you want to click on that and enable it and then you'll see this app data folder go to that then local then you want to find packages uh, then under packages you'll see microsoft.minecraft somewhere in here yeah microsoft.minecraft uwp with a bunch of random letters uh, go to that then after that, you want to go to local state, you want to go to games, com.mojang, and then after that, you should go to uh, Minecraft PE, because that's what it calls it for some reason. And then you'll see options.txt. You might not have it open like this. All you have to do if you want to change that is right click, do open with a notepad, which every Windows computer has. In my case, I can simply open it like this. Then you want to scroll down to where it says GFX VSync right here. For you guys, it will say one. For me, it says zero because I already changed it. And then you can just launch the game without any input delay. So now if I launch Bedrock Edition or Windows 10 Edition, for some reason, this isn't an option in the base game, but it's in the options text file. So as long as you change it there, it actually removes all forms of just VSync on anything. So if I just go to like Cubecraft, for example, or whatever, and you'll see even in the lobby, it's completely different. Uh, you can see I can move my mouse freely. There's no problems with it. I don't know why this isn't an option you can toggle in the game. Kind of weird. Um, and yeah, I'll link the forum post I found in the description that basically showed me how to do this and makes the game just almost basically just as good as Java, but without Optifine Zoom, of course. Um, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the next